I didn't just hang up the tree and step. Nope, that didn't happen. Welcome back to mid 10 y'all. Got the old hay trailer hooked up. I need to move a couple of rolls of hay. So I thought, you know what? My brother's got this new tractor sitting over here. We'll just come use it. We'll be the first one to use it. Cause you know, that's what, that's what brothers do. You don't let you, you don't let them use our stuff, you use it. So we're gonna figure this Kubota out. The old Kubota. And like you gotta come up here like this and flip these like this. That seems right. And we'll go dump this bucket off. And we will, uh, we will, we will, we will, we will load some hay. If I keep saying that, we will. Oh man, look, he's done got his fancy floor mat in here. He got him a tractor mat. Fancy. Son. I do owe him one though. One time he may or may not have tore the muffler completely off my 47. Sign robotics. So, we'll, we'll let that slide though. All right, we got her forward. And they brought this thing on almost a full tank of diesel. That's crazy. I wouldn't sell something with a full tank of diesel. All right. The downside is this is a newer tractor. There ain't a whole lot of metal surfaces to clamp this camera to. Is that metal up there? Is that metal? Is that metal? Oh, son, look at that's metal. It's too high. It's too high. Oh look, we can go back here. Yeah, look at that. Now we got it. That thumbs away. We found a spot of metal to put it on. Oh, one side's not unlocked. It come unlocked. We either get this figured out or we'll hurt ourselves. I'll get this new floor mat, floor mat all dirty. Get dirt all over it. I think I got it unhooked. Oh yeah, look at that. That was easy. No wonder people like these quick attachments. So we can get the hay spare on there. Oh, missed it. Low range, low range. I think I got it. Well, I kind of got it. I kind of got it. Oh, come on, door. There we go. I'll scoot the seat back some. That's better. I'm worried about that. Market break, high range, first gear, reverse. We'll get it figured out. If not, we'll wreck it out of it. Let's 
Whoa. Okay, these bells are old. We're gonna take these back and feed them to the to the cows. To get rid of. That's what we're doing with this hay. I got two rolls of hay left at the other farm. These are not the best rolls of hay. I think me and this side, they're like, the ones I'm getting right now are like three years old. So it'll be fall cutting like fall 21, I think. Or maybe spring 22. Yeah, cause I got let's see three, six, seven, eight, eight of these old bells. You now since we got the other loader on well, the cab butter back at the other farm, I can feed some cows with it because I need to hook the red case up to the little planter. That way we can get this get that one going. Oh yeah, that is, that's not much of a bell hay right there. <laughs> like a quarter bell hay. Uh, that might be older than I think it is. Well, they need to get out of the way anyways. Well, they ain't far from not being here. <laughs> squaring up on that muffler nail from years ago. Oh, we'll call that a sh**. What do you take your time and yeah, it'll ride. Looks like garbage. Hot garbage. Hot, hot garbage. Okay, so this is different. I'll show you when I fill in there. Back in the barn. Parking brake. Oh, put it neutral. So what I was saying was different is the AC is down here. So it blows right on your legs. I'm used to AC being up here and blowing in your face. But, oh good, look, we got a mess of string on the, on underneath it already. Get that off of there. 
not bad. I'd say for doing loader work, yeah, it gets A+. Plus. Then we'll see if I can get my hot load of garbage over here to the house. <sighs> Getting a bad lean. <laughs> so, I got these two quarter rolls right here. Half a roll, half a roll of hay. That's probably half, but it's old. And it'll probably get dumped in the ditch up to the farm. So, 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 let's get on the road and get going before we dump this stuff off. We're getting them unloaded. Some of them are just a little bit thinner than others. So I picked this one up off the trailer and the bottom come off. We got the top stuck, so we're gonna dump it out here in the field. If it wouldn't have been so wet, I'd pulled the truck and trailer over here in the pasture and loaded over here. But we got a pretty good bit of rain yesterday. It's gonna take me just a little bit longer to unload it than I want it to. But you know, we'll get it done. I'm gonna kind of dump this out in some areas where I'm trying to control some erosion. Right here. That's a good spot. Let's say I got water coming around that gate and going down this cow pass. People's was going down the hill and cutting a rut. Making a wash and I fed hay here and there to help fill the wash in. And now it stopped the water and all this extra hay will catch. We'll catch that water. So I say it wasn't much of a hay bale left. So you can see right there, there's the other quarter of the hay bale. And uh, we'll figure out a way to get that off in a little bit. So I'm gonna keep unloading my junk hay here. And we'll catch up y'all here in a little bit. We're gonna put some duels back on the tractor. We got some other equipment servers. Be a full day of stuff. Folks, we're about to get a duel and roll over here and try not to crush ourselves. Super windy right now. So we'll just, so that goes, might set this over here. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> you got it, Ruby? Yeah. Yeah. It's not like me getting heavy. Super heavy, wasn't it? Yeah, it's super. Super heavy. It's super heavy. Super heavy. It's super heavy. Stay back, okay? All right. Well, now I think we can rotate it around some. If my calculations are right, they're probably wrong now. I think I might have it. All right, one tire on. Not horrible. Plus side is I didn't drop it on myself or the children. I did have to fuss at the kids and make them go inside. That was safety reason though. That was for safety. 
wouldn't call us trying to be a mean old dad or not, nothing. I shouldn't need that tire to fall on me. It'd be bad enough if it fell on me. So, we get the next saw shot set up over here. Looks good, boom. We gotta get the rim, gotta get the tire from leaning on the truck. I got it off the ground, propped it up the other day on the fed hay, and we gotta put it on the tractor. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Well, we did one by ourselves, we can do the other. Yep, yep. All right, we might actually be pretty, pretty close to being on the holes right there. That would be nice. We're gonna be close. We're gonna be close. So, what I'm doing is I'm getting a bolt in it, in on the top. We'll jack it up a little bit, and I'll set my block back here, and I'll pry the tire around and get her more, more squared up to where we can get some more bolts in it. Just get a couple bolts started, and a couple more, and a couple more. Before you know it, you got a tire bolted on. Now it's feeling straighter. A little bit more. We'll get another one or two bolts in. That's it. Duels are back on. Alrighty. We got both the duels back on. We got everything greased. I greased the front wheel burns, got my spindles, got my U joints. Put a little added a little more extra grease to the new burns back there. Because the burns that were added that were going bad would have been right here on the end of this shaft. So every axle, I think there's, there's at least one, there's one set of bearings in there, I think, both sides, bearing seals. But they tore it off, tore this side off, took that other side right there off, and replaced the bearings and the seals. Said my brakes look good. Said the, pad, the, said the pads look great. So didn't touch them, but new bearings on both sides. Went ahead and added a little extra grease to that. And what we'll do, we'll have to run it a little bit and then check the lug nuts right here, make sure they're good and tight. Basically, I mean, besides a bath, it needs a bath, something fierce like, and maybe some muffler paint. Besides that, she's ready to roll for another year. But with that being said, I'm gonna finish up just a little bit of stuff. It is a Friday evening, might call it early, you know, 
go spend some family time. I had to run the kids off all ago. Didn't want one of them duels to crush them. That would have been a that had been a bad day, and the wife probably would not never let me live that and down. So, like always, if you're liking what you see, feel free to subscribe, drop a comment, all that stuff. Uh, Y'all notice we've been putting some shorts out on the, on the YouTube, and uh, yeah, they might be a little, bit, a little bit more adult, but they're funny. At least we find them funny. But like always, the good Lord's willing, we'll catch you on the flip side. Until the next.